What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Well, I got my tripod fixed and I left it at home. So I'm going to set you up any which way I can today to get mowing footage for you. I did the first one down the street there. I got these two back to back so I'll try to get some here for you. And uh, hey, want to thank you guys for subscribing to the channel, hitting the like button, and uh, if you're enjoying the videos and only if and you uh say hey doc i want to support the channel hit that thanks button and uh hey a dollar goes a long way man keeps me motivated to do the videos and i hope you guys are enjoying them but uh man it's going to be 95 real fill will be well over 105 today so i'm going to get to work and get these things knocked out i got 12 on the docket I don't know, boys. I don't know if we'll get them, but we'll try. See you in a few. together of the mowing for you today and then we'll talk at the end let me uh let's see what the temp is right now it is 8 46 and let's see here the real fill well let me take my glasses off real fill is 78 right now not too bad but uh, when you trim, you sweat. So uh, let me get these done. I'll show you the after view. Okay, guys. There they are. The afters of these two. Not bad. A little wet, a little clumpy. But uh, let's blow it out a little bit. And uh whew getting warm so let's move on to the next one next one's pretty big i probably won't record there i'll probably record some of the smaller stuff for you today so uh hey just saying if it breaks there it is all right talk to you soon guys okay guys so this is what happens when uh the rocks kick up out of the tremor Whew. didn't think it cut me but i kept feeling something warm on my face just got uh this one over here trimmed and uh woo 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 it is hot so i'm gonna get this thing cut then we'll get some footage at the next one see you soon
All right, guys. I know it's not ideal, but I tried to get you some mowing footage. The reason that thing got all that dead grass in it is last week when I cut it, she had waited a week because they had fertilized it. I didn't want to wait a week, but she did, and uh, that's what you get. That's what you get right there. That is a mess. Love it. Love dealing with it, but you know, the yard looks good still. Um, a lot of stuff in the air. Man, we're hitting 100 degrees right now, so let me get this done and uh, get to the last two, and I'll talk to you guys there. Okay, guys. Look, I know I didn't get a lot of footage. I'm sorry. I will have my tripod with me tomorrow. Um, what I want to talk to you about today is really important for everyone. And you can say, well, Doc, you're wrong. I don't give an I don't give two shits what you say. But I'm right. You better take care of your health out in this heat, man. Now, you may hate me, but I'm right about that. Uh you better stay hydrated. If you can find something that helps you along. Now, the yard boy, you guys who watch my channel know. If you don't know the yard boy, he's in a lot of my comments. He is a, uh, I, I don't know if you call it spokesman, salesman, whatever. And he's not a salesman for him. He just is a uh, representative for AdvoCare. And AdvoCare is basically what all your top athletes and and uh, people out there who are doing sports, things like that, they use it. And Sarah and I started it when we started our weight loss journey and our healthier lifestyle. And it is wonderful, man. Wonderful. So they got a thing called Rehydrate. It's, it's. I don't want to say it's like Gatorade. I want to say it's 10 times better, okay? You don't have all the sugar. You don't have caffeine in it. It's wonderful. You got your sparks. A lot of you guys are jumping on board with uh, Corey. And uh, look, I am doing this because I'm hoping Corey will see the video and send me all kinds of free stuff. No, I'm just kidding. But I really want to tell you guys, you better take care of your health, man. I had five yards left. I was real close, but it is 102 degrees here today with the heat index. And I am not going to push it. I'm not going to sit out here and continually go and continually go until I just can't go anymore. By that time, you are dehydrated. Your body... It, it's not good for your heart. It's not good for your system. Um, I got seven yards done today by one o'clock and uh, I'm home now. But I want you guys all to take care of yourselves. I mean, wh whether, doesn't matter, man, who you are, take care of your health. You know, it's funny, we will spend thousands of dollars on lawnmowers. And, and we wash them and we baby them. And and there's guys who even polish their lawn mowers, okay? But when it comes to your health, you throw sugar in it, you throw garbage in it, fast food, uh, and, then, and then you sit there and go, well, man, I don't feel good. Well, what would you do if I threw sugar in the gas tank of that mower? it would not run so when you're putting bad stuff in your body guess what it don't want to run we got to check in with this lady right here how are you dear guess what what i enjoy bacon periodically you are a chemist at heart aren't you ah uh, yeah but it's fun isn't it well you're a chemist anyway because you have a degree i do so I like the shirt. Where did we get that? Cracker Barrel. Cracker Barrel, yes. We were with the Lawn Stars. We were. Yes. We were with the Big Mo and the King. The King. 
So, oh, what's that? I better get my hovercraft right. Uh, I think it's coming. Um, anyway, uh, guys, I just want you to take care of your health. Please, if you feel dizzy, if you feel faint, stop working for a while. Sit down in a cool place, get something to drink. If and and I know this is going to sound a little weird, but if you stop urinating throughout the day, you are already dehydrated, okay? And uh, that's not a good sign. I know uh, Leo's landscaping, he did a video a couple years ago, man. He had to go to the ER and get fluids. He dehydrated so bad. It, I know Big Mo has been dehydrated. Um, it's, it's not a joke. You have to watch what you're doing out here. That's why, could I have stayed out till 5 o'clock? Yeah, I could have. I don't know what shape I would have been in. It would have been bad. The work, you know, the yards were going to suffer for it. I was going to suffer for it. And it's not worth it. I can go out in the morning, be there at 7. I'll be done by 11. And all my yards are done. And I'm home. And I'm not roasting. So, that's all I got for you today, guys. I'm sorry it wasn't the best video in the world. Hope you guys are staying cool. And uh, take care of yourselves. Go to work early. Get done early. Get out of this heat. As always, Dr. Real was in the house. Keep it real and a blind touch was in the house, right? Well, you were in the house, weren't you? Yeah. All day. Yeah. Okay. Guys, we love you. Be safe. I'm out of here. Peace.